initiating system one. System one loaded. Hi everyone, I'm Joanna Sonda. And I'm Kevin G. Sabino. We're third year students taking a Bachelor of Science in Information System. From Philippine Women's University, Batahan Branch. In this video, we're going to discuss the introduction of human-computer interaction or also known as HCI. Types of human-computer interaction 1. Command Line Interface A command line interface allows the user to interact directly with the computer system by typing A commands or instructions into a screen. Menu Driven Interface this type of interface lets you interact with a computer or device by working your way through your series of screen or menus. Graphical User Interface A graphical user interface or GUI is the most common type of user interface in use today. It is a very friendly way for people to interact with a computer because it makes use of features, graphics, and icons. A GUI is also known as a WIMP interface because it makes use of windows, icons, menus, and pointers. 4. Natural Language This type of interface allows the user to speak or type in their normal everyday language in order to interact with a computer. This is the most technically challenging form of interface for the designers. At least has to cope with the different accents, dialects, slangs, and homonyms. Human-computer interaction is important for several reasons. 1. Quality of life Important applications of computers in medicine are possible only if they are both useful and easy to use by doctors and nurses. Similarly, use of computers in education requires that they be both useful and easy to use by students and teachers. Computer can assist disabled individuals. At the same time, special techniques are needed to allow computers to be used by some who are disabled. National Competitiveness Information technology is one of the drivers for increased productivity. As more and more workers use computers in their jobs, training time and ease of use, issues become economically more and more important. Growth of the computer and communication industries Powerful, interesting, and usable applications are the fuel for continuing growth of these industries. The current growth cycle is the direct consequence of the graphical user interface developed by Xerox and commercialized by Apple and Microsoft. And of the lower computer cost made possible by the microprocessor, the resulting mass market supports commodity pricing for both hardware and software. Future growth cycles will be in part be driven in current HEI research which will lead to the new applications that are increasingly easy to use.
What is human computer interaction? Human computer interaction is a discipline concerned with the study, design, construction, and implementation of human centric interactive computer systems. CI. HCI stands for Human Computer Interaction, which is the study of how people interact with technology interfaces. This includes computers and how people interact with a keyboard, mouse, and monitor to retrieve, process, and search for information. But this also includes almost all other pieces of today's technologies, such as cell phones, MP3 players, such as the iPod. The whole goal of HCI is to figure out how to design technologies such to make it simple, accessible, and useful. An important subset of HCI is value-sensitive design. What makes a piece of technology usable? Again, simplicity, usefulness, and accessibility are among the key traits we strive towards in usability design. HCI caters designed to the people with the goal of making today's complex technologies more usable to as many people as possible. For Thank you for watching guys. We hope you learned something from our video.